is a breaking news special report. One man is dead tonight in what Rochester police are calling a murder investigation. This is a breaking news story you saw first tonight on KTTC.com. I'm Brock Burgey. Caitlin is off tonight. Police telling us this fatal shooting does not. It does not appear to be random. Let's show you a map of the crime scene. RPD saying the shooting happened near 10th Street Southeast and 1st Avenue Southeast. Now, this is right along Broadway Avenue north of Highway 14. To help put that into perspective for you, the location just south of Olmstead Medical Center's Southeast Clinic. We want to bring in KTTC's Megan Zempel live near the crime scene for us tonight. Megan, we know this is still an active crime scene in a residential area. Have you heard if police have anyone in custody for this shooting death? Is there any public safety concern right now for folks in this southeast Rochester neighborhood? Hi, Brock. We're actually right outside uh, the house of where it happened. We're on 10 and 10 and a quarter street. Uh, police really at this point are really not telling us a whole lot. We asked if there is someone in custody right now. They aren't saying either way if there is anyone in custody, but we do understand that right now there is no danger to the public. We uh, do understand that this happened just before seven o'clock tonight. It is an adult male. Male, uh, who did suffer gunshot wounds. The, uh, life saving measures were performed and unfortunately this man did not survive. Uh, we do understand as Brock, as you mentioned, this was not a random or this was this was uh, not random at this point. Um, we did talk to some of the neighbors here and they say that this particular house is known for some activity that um, at sometimes can be troublesome. One neighbor said that they saw three to four people get arrested and put into police cars. This has not been confirmed by police at this point. This was just an eyewitness testimony. So we do hope to find more information out about this uh, homicide later on tonight or even tomorrow morning. So stay with KTTC as we learn more information on this. Reporting live in Southeast Rochester, Megan Zeppel, KTTC News. Megan, we appreciate you covering this for us, being on the scene and providing us with the updates. Thank you so much.